Hey guys, Cece coming at you real quick with a haul video and this video is um, composed of drugstore products that I picked up from Target and also five below yesterday. So I wanted to just show you guys what I got. So if you want to see what I got, definitely stay tuned. Before we get into it, I just want to let you all know that I do post videos now every single Monday and every single Thursday. So you can see this face two times a week. And then I also throw in surprise videos throughout the week. So you want to make sure you're subscribed so you get all of the notifications for all of my videos. Now that that is out the way... Let's get into the haul. So the first thing I picked up is like the star of this haul. It's the thing I went into Target for. And it is the Nivea um, Men's Post Shave Balm Insensitive. Now we all have seen this all over the internet. Thank you Nikki Tutorials for getting everybody on this bandwagon. But this is the Nivea Men's Post Shave Balm. And it's huge. Like as you can see it will take me forever to use this up. It's like $5.59. So very affordable. And she says that this is like the mother of all primers. So of course as we do, we all went out and got this. I have it on my face today, and I mean, I don't see anything wrong with it. Um, it does smell like men's cologne, but um, when you put your makeup over it, I don't smell it anymore. But um, I mean, I don't see anything wrong with it. I don't see it as overly great. Uh, I just put my makeup on too, so maybe I'll see more throughout the day. But I don't see it as overly great, but for $5, I mean, that makes it better than my high-end primers right <laughs> right so I also grabbed a couple of elf products from Target I got this elf illuminating palette I have been wanting to get this forever but elf don't be running no specials no more and so I just don't want to pay for shipping on their website I just I don't know I just don't want to pay for it and then I'm always trying to wait on specials but like I said elf doesn't run specials anymore on the new products the stuff you want so I just found this at Target and usually my Target doesn't have the newer stuff but it did have this palette so I was really excited I heard these are kind of like a um, drugstore version of the hourglass ambient lighting powders I mean I have one of those powders so we'll see if that's true but I did swatch them and the powders were very very soft and they're a little powdery but they're really soft I mean really really soft they don't give that much color payoff so um, we'll see I'll be interested to see how I use this the next thing I grabbed from Target was the e.l.f. bronzer palette and I think I'm going to return this because on the picture the bronzers look so much darker than they actually are in the pan and like I don't feel like these are going to bronze up my skin very much so I think I'm just going to go ahead and exchange this for something else but that's the bronzer palette and this one is in bronze beauty. I don't know if there's more than one. I haven't purchased any um, elf products in a while so maybe I'll go to their site and just do like a mega haul or something I don't know let me know if you guys want to see some more elf products anyway I went to oh you know what before I show you what I got from five below sorry for the bad guys I'll get rid of it but before I show you what I got from five below I received this mascara from um total life changes and it is from TLC skincare and it is the 3d fiber mascara and this is what it looks like they sent this to me to review and um, I'll have their information in the bottom bar but I will definitely be doing a full review on this mascara or maybe a demo on first impressions maybe I'll do that a demo on first impressions on this mascara very soon I want to read up on it and see what it's supposed to do but like I said they sent me this so so thank you to them and I will definitely be doing a video on this soon. All right, getting into the stuff I got from Five Below, they always have the best stuff. Like, I have to stay out of there because they have some really good stuff. But I got this Wet n Wild. This is one of the new Wet n Wild brushes, and this is their crease brush. And so I ended up grabbing this. I think this was $2.00. I got this for at Five Below, and I showed you guys one of these in my Wet n Wild haul, but I got the, um, sh the, what is it? I got this one, and this one is the, they don't have names on them, but it's just like a shader brush. So now I have the fluffy blending crease brush, so we'll see how that works. 
Then I grabbed the Shrobing Highlighter Kit. This is by a brand called Beauty Treats. I've never heard of the brand before, but when you can get a Shrobing Highlighter Kit for $4, like you have to investigate, right? Right. So that's what I call this. I call this my investigation. But this is what it looks like, and you get six colors. I'm just now opening it for the first time. And it looks like you get three cream highlighters and then you get three powder highlighters that correspond to the cream ones up here and hmm. so you get like a pinky one a goldish one and then almost like a rose gold one I don't know if you can see that but I am going to have to try these out in a video. If you guys want to see any of these products in a video, please let me know and we can do that. Next product is a City Color product and this is their Extreme Bold Liquid Eyeliner with Brush Tip for Precision. And it says you can do a fine line or you can do a bold line. So I will be using this as well. I think I'm going to try to do like a first, I'm like so over the place, all over the place, I'm sorry. But I think I'm going to do like a first impressions full face video maybe or eye look video. I don't know. I'm going to work that out in my head. Lastly, I have the City Color Contour Stick, and this is in the color Deep, and I saw that they had a light, they had a medium, and then they had a deep, and I got the deep because the medium just didn't look dark enough. I should have grabbed the medium too, but I didn't, but the medium just didn't look as dark as I wanted it to look, so I just grabbed the deep. Anyway, that's what it looks like, and as you can see, you twist it up. I think NYX came out with one of these and Wet n Wild is coming out with one of these as well. But you just twist it up and you get the color. Ooh. It is beautiful and cool tone too. Honey. Oh, we're going to be contouring with this. Yes. Ooh, I like that. And then, so I've been listening to, let me tell y'all, I've been listening to Beyonce all day. Y'all heard her new song? Because I slept. Cause that's like, cause that's I've been listening to that all day and all yesterday, and I'm just in love with that song. Queen B has done it again. I just wanted to throw that in there. Anyway, the highlighting side right here. This is comes with a little doe foot applicator. Ooh, ooh, girl, y'all know I've been dipping into City Color, and I have been liking what I see. So go ahead, City Color. That, again, I got from Five Below. This was like $3, so again, super affordable. All right, guys, so those are all of the things that I picked up while I was out shopping. If you guys want to see any of these um, products in, like, a review video or a tutorial, any type of deeper video on any of these products, then I would definitely go ahead and get that done for you. Just let me know down below. Don't forget to comment, rate, and subscribe. I love you guys so much. Thank you so much for watching and supporting me, and I will talk to you in the next video. Bye, guys.